All right, Nicole McLennan will now welcome in another senior. Morgan Toll will join us. So Morgan, I was at the uh, final regular season series and I did not think I would be seeing you playing softball again at that point. You had an injury there. So when that happened, what went through your mind and how were you able to get back out there and make such big contributions? When it first happened, I was just, I was freaking out because I'm very prone to injuries. I always hurt my knees or my hamstrings. And it was kind of just like, what am I going to do to get myself back in for regionals? I knew PSAX was out of the question, so that I could live with. And we knew that we were going to be a regional contender. We were the second seed. So I talked to my trainers and they sent me to get dry needling done in my hamstring actually and got me right back for regionals to be the DP and thankfully I was okay to play the field again with my friends. And, and certainly made some good plays defensively but let's talk a little bit about the bat today because you went two for four very easily could have been four for four you laced a couple <laughs> of line outs I'm sure you're sick of seeing Kutztown's third, yeah. third baseman. Uh, it seemed like you were locked in what worked for you at the plate? Um, just being patient. I mean, like you see the whole season, I like to swing at the first pitch. I'm always a first pitch swinger, but kind of just like thinking I just need to get on base, like just kind of just do my thing, like stay smooth in the box. And Coach Sabane always works with me. So I, d I really just wanted to get on at that point. Like I was 0 for, for a while and I was like kind of just wanted to do something for my team. And I'm glad my bat finally found a hole. <laughs> Coach Stone's a really good team. Uh, obviously, we know that they're here for a reason. They, they're they the reigning PSAC champions. Yeah. They've actually been to uh, the championship series a couple times in program history. How did, how did they maybe force your team to up its level of play? We just needed to be stronger. Like, we don't play a lot of the PSAC East teams, so we don't really know, like, what they have for us. Like, last time we played them is in 2015, so obviously none of us were there. And we kind of just wanted to come out, bring our energy, and just know, like, we've been saying it since the first day we got to Seton Hill this year. Like, we were going to be World Series contenders, and kind of just always working for that goal just kept the energy up. So let's talk about uh, the coaching staff and, and head coach Jessica Strong. What stands out about her? Her, like, mouth. Like, she's just loud. Coach Strong's in a, a very, in a good, in a good way. Right? way. Okay, like she's okay. just very loud, and like when something good happens, like she's a really big cheerleader in the dugout. Like she's doing half the cheers with us, which you don't see a lot of coaches doing. So I think she really keeps us engaged in the game. And yet she does everything in her power to try to get out of doing these post-game interviews. I don't, I don't get it. You <laughs> yeah, think it would come not a very good public speaker, I guess. <laughs> uh, when did you know that this team was special? Literally, like, the first day we had practice. I mean, even, like, Jenna, Nicole, all the seniors, like, we knew from the day we got here, like, this team was going to make it to the World Series. Like, I was talking to Nicole, actually, a couple days ago, and we made it far last year. We made it to the PSAC Championship first time ever. Chips just didn't fall into place, and we told ourselves, like, this is the year, and then the chips are finally falling, so. I know it was not easy for some of the fans to make the trek here, and then they had to stay an extra day, but how much did it mean to have that support? Having our fans here is, like, the greatest thing. Like, just seeing all the parents supporting us. They have their own Facebook page, and they always get to post updates on there. So just having them mesh together helps us mesh together, too. Morgan, congratulations. Go enjoy this Thank one. Thank you so much. That's yeah, baby! <laughs> Getting a little wet afterwards, deservedly so. Yep. Still working here, hopefully.